My relationship with music began by listening to jazz on the radio. I was listening to one day George Benson and I was really inspired. Well, uh, I suppose at, in, at the moment, um, I'm really inspired by Dua Lipa, the artist. She's a great singer-songwriter. Um, and I also like Michael Buble and, and Bruno Mars. Um, well, yeah, I mean, I, I listen to, you know, jazz artists like John Coltrane, Miles Davis, Wes Montgomery, um, and singers, um, Aretha Franklin, Whitney Houston, amazing artists. Yeah, I have noticed a shift in, in the way artists approach music today. Uh, fortunately, we do have some great artists like Ed Sheeran, Sam Smith, and also um, Dua Lipa. Um, they're young artists um, who are writing their own music, and so there is hope for the future. But yeah, there is a lot of technology that sometimes can be used in a good way as a tool, but sometimes when it's used to cover to compensate for the artist's talent there. I don't agree with that. Yeah, well, in, in 2004, um, I, was, I joined Jazz Jamaica, um, and they are like a 12-piece ska reggae band, similar to the band here in Argentina, Dancing Mood. In fact, we are very similar to them. We play very famous jazz songs and make them reggae and ska. Well, Amy was a wonderful person. She, she was um, very kind, generous. Um, she, if she liked you, she, she made, you felt like she was your best friend. You know, you, she, I, felt like, I felt like I was put special to her, like she made you feel special. That was her biggest quality, I think, as a human being. And as an artist, she left a huge um, statement, you know, a huge legacy really for, she inspired many artists that we have today, such as um, Lady Gaga, um, Duffy, um, even Dua Lipa says her favourite artist is Amy. So she influenced a lot of people, I think that's her, her legacy. As a musician and as a person, she was an incredible, lovely, lovely person. Well, there's a little story here that when they called me, I was driving my car and I had to take the call and I had to pull over because you cannot use the phone and drive. So, And uh, I was on my way to the pizza place to play music in the pizza place. This was my job. <laughs> so it was like then suddenly this opportunity came with Amy Winehouse and she remembered me from the previous meeting. And... Uh, I suppose what I give to the music is my vibe. My like I'm, I love jazz, soul, reggae, all styles of music, and I think they were looking for somebody who can fit into the role, um, or was able to fit into the role of playing the Frank album and the Back to Black album, which was very jazzy and very pop Motown. They needed somebody who can do the, all the styles. So I think that is my quality is I can play all the styles quite well.